today, Satan. Not today, Nick. Not today, ankles. We don't have it. Questions. Where's my cocktail? Where? That's my opinion. All right. You ruined it. You ruined it. You did. Uh, what the f is this? The lies. There you the go. Lies. There you go. <laughs> you are the biggest bully in Hollywood, and everyone knows it. Hello everyone and before we start it is time to give a shout out to our partners of this video and are the beautiful people of Rose Forever. They did this amazing bouquet of flowers with special oils that will make the roses last up to a year. This is the perfect gift for you, your mom, your wife, your husband, whatever you want to say, I'm sorry, I love you, I miss you, say it with these beautiful flowers. So if you want to get your bouquet right now, go to the link on the description below and use my discount code ANDY25 and you will get $25 off your order. Again, this is the perfect gift for anyone. So whatever you want to say, say it with roses from Rose Forever. Hello, Beverly Troop. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beverly Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. It is Sunday, and you know what that means. It's all about a fun day. It's all about having fun. How many of you are drinking a mimosa right now? And how many of you need to start drinking a mimosa right now? Girl, go to brunch. And if you don't have a brunch place wherever you are, buy a bottle of, of you know, cheap champagne or, you know, sparkling wine or whatever and orange juice and then do mimosas at home. Like, fuck everyone else. Girl. Um, it is time to talk about Vanderpump Rules, Scandal, and everything in between because Mr. Peter Madrigal, yes, the unofficial cast member of Vanderpump Rules, is coming forward with some tea where, where he is kind of like alleging that Scandal might be a little bit longer than what Mr. Sandoval and Mr. Ra Miss Rachel is letting the world know. Mm -hmm. Which, by the way, I already gave you my whole theory of what I think really went down with those two and, and that how I think they have been going together since she was with James Kennedy. That's what I believe, you know? I think this whole seven-month thing, oh, it was like, like, oh, let's say this, so we are not into, like, too deep shit, but things, things, it doesn't add up. You know, it doesn't add up. To me, I cannot pass the fact that he is paying thousands of dollars to throw an engagement party called Raquela, Ra Raquela, Raquela, or something like that for her engagement, but it's all about Rachel. And he's paying for everything. And he doesn't even really like James. So like, what? <laughs> so uh, to me, those two have been in cahoots for a very, very long time. Okay, but now... Peter Madrigal is coming forward. You know what? I really, like, I love Peter, but I don't know why he has never been really involved. He's kind of like Christina Kelly. He has been there since day one. He goes to the reunions to, to serve the shots, the whole thing. But we have never really been able to explore, you know, the depths of Peter Madrigal. And I don't know why. I don't know why they have never actually given him a chance. Or maybe they did and he didn't deliver. I don't know. But don't you think it's kind of like weird? Like this person has been there all the time. He knows everything. He knows everyone. He looks, he knows everything that is going on. And he just like, whatever, he, whenever he decided to appear, he will appear, drop a little bomb, then leaves. I don't know. But anyways. Uh, so he's revealing <coughs> that uh, he was on, on Kristen's uh, podcast and he's revealing uh, a text message that he received from Tom Sandoval from the time that he was dating uh, Raquel, you know, and he is calling them out saying that 100% um 
Raquel was using him as a decoy and that he was sure that something else, now looking back at the whole scandal, that he believes that something else was going on. Yes, a lot, a lot of tea. So let me read you this. It says, Peter Madrigal just revealed an interesting text from Tom Sandoval before the news of his affair with Raquel Levis broke. The timeline of Peter's claims suggests their relationship began before Peter and Raquel's on-screen fling on Vanderpump Rules. Recently, Peter claimed Raquel used him as a ploy while the affair was ongoing. The exact starting point of the scandal has been debated, but Peter's new revelation seemingly proved it was happening long before people realized. On the Sex, Love, and What Else Matter podcast shared by... Uh, okay, uh, wait, sorry guys. Peter revealed an interesting text he received from Sandoval after the first episode of the season after six months of no text from Tom. He said, and, the te and then he texts me and he says, quote, dude, just watch the first episode, LOL. Did you bang uh, Raquel the night after sore? Say Peter, who alleged Tom added a crying, laughing face. The text suggests that Tom was already having the affair before Peter and Raquel began dating on camera. It also suggests Tom was jealous, attempting to find out if Raquel was cheating on him, probably. At this point, it's a, a speculation, though more and more details seem to show that the relationship was much deeper than it appeared. Recently, Sandoval's pal Tom Short addressed his scandal, defending his friend, blah, 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 blah. That's another thing. So anyways, um, I'm telling you, this is, going, this is going way back. Like, I am not being fooled by this whole thing. Like, oh, it's Star After Vegas, uh, you know, at boys' night. No, the way that they were looking at each other, the way that they were... No, this, this, is, this was going on way way before that and i'm pretty sure that at some point we will uh get to the truth of this i'm telling you this girl was cheating on james with tom sandoval i'm pretty sure pretty sure okay and uh i'm maybe that's why you know allegedly james kennedy and sandoval were the ones fighting at the reunion i don't know so anyways that's it let me know what you guys think in the comments below when do you think this affair actually start? Let me know. And if you want to get all the tea related to Vanderpump Rules or any of the other Bravo shows, make sure to subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.